What's up, everybody? This is Parker from the Fast Foodies Podcast, back with another protein bar review. Today, I'm trying out another MCT bar. I've reviewed a few other, other flavors. I'll make sure to leave a link to the playlist either up here or down below in the video description below so you can check out what I thought of their other flavors. I've tried their cocoa flavor and their caramel sea salt. So today, I'm gonna to switch it up a little and try a little bit of fruity flavor. Today, we're gonna to be trying out their Banana Beautiful. Now, all their protein bars use collagen protein and have no added sugars. Also, if these bars sound good to you, then you can actually head on over to their website, which I will also link down below, and you can pick up a box of six and just pay for shipping. Anyway, let's get in to the review. This is what the protein bar looks like. Cut off a piece, let's get into the taste test. I really like that. Oh, and what I like about that, it's not just banana. Actually, if you can see on the packaging, there's cinnamon sticks on there, and there's a really nice cinnamon flavor. And I think even like a hint of caramel, so you get a nice contrast between banana, cinnamon, even that caramel flavor which I love. I think bananas and caramel go great together. Ooh, I was really just expecting kind of, not a bland banana flavor, but you know, just kind of the run of the mill banana protein bar flavor. However, the banana combined with that cinnamon flavor and caramel, that's a dangerous combination. That's really good. Texture wise, it's not, not super grainy. Not, there's nothing really to say negative about that. It does dissolve in the mouth right after you bite into it, I find. However, it does form kind of like a nice paste when after you chew it and you let it dissolve. And actually what I'm gonna try now is, I'm gonna try microwaving it. What I did last time with the, I think it was with the sea salt, I didn't film this, but I put a piece in the, in the microwave and I had it heated up and it actually made it a lot better, which was kind of hard, Pretty surprising considering how good it was just on its own but i want to see if microwaving a piece of this protein bar brings out that caramel and cinnamon flavor even more be right back so i just popped in a piece in the microwave for about i think it was 22 seconds just until it got a little bit melted. Now, I got a fork actually. I'm gonna see how it tastes melted, or microwaved, I should say. It's definitely a lot softer. Yeah, just as I hoped. That brings out the banana, caramel, cinnamon flavor even more. And it also, it changes the texture. So now it's like nice and doughy. It's almost like a cookie dough texture, I'd say. Ooh. Yeah, that honestly tastes like a caramel banana cookie dough. That's really good. Let's get into the ratings for this bar. So just as is, a protein bar, not microwaved or anything. I'm gonna give that an 8.5 out of 10. However, after sticking in the microwave, I think I'm gonna give that a 9.5 out of 10, which is actually really surprising. I thought, I thought my favorite was gonna be that caramel sea salt. However, this, this is right up there. This is a this is one of the best banana flavored protein bars I've had. There's no really artificial banana taste at all. This is a good one. If, if you like your bananas, caramel, cinnamon, definitely pick this one up. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. If you want to hear more, check out Fast Foodies Podcast on Apple Podcasts and Spotify.